little TV. Okay. Don't go. Get your tongue out of there, B. <laughs> What's going on? Their tongues are sticking up before I go. Oh, okay. She comes. Oh, that's a very light, honey. It's very light. Fly. Doesn't look like there's any flooding. Ah, oh, piss off, fly. Seriously? There's not a bee, it's a fly. Ooh! It's a very different flavour. Is that? <laughs> yeah. I'll take them to the other one. Yeah. Twitter. Hi. Twitter. That is really thick honey. <laughs> I'll see about doing two at once, but I think they're too close together. Get away. It's worse than flies of babies.
This might take a little while. Get out of there. Ten flies. It's very, very sticky. It's a very light flavour. Mm -hmm. It's not. Mm -hmm. Basically, we've got uh, honey, honey, and honey. Yeah. That's the one they've started working on again. <clears throat> Plus, the ideal's full of honey. Full of honey. So they've got plenty of honey. Yeah. So, this will probably be the last harvest we do anyway. Possibly. It depends on whether we have a cold winter or a mild one. Yeah. <clears throat> So we might not even worry about taking honey out of the um, the ideal. The ideal, yeah. We might just leave it. Well, you've got plenty of honey up the top as well. Well. You have. Yeah, you've got four of winter. Maybe one or two well, frames out of the ideal. Well, you'll have to we see. might, we'll, we'll see what you're doing. Yeah. I, can, I wouldn't take probably more than two out of it, just, just because <coughs> it's a pretty healthy colony, so they're going to need plenty of... They're going to need plenty of honey. Oh, plenty of honey. Do they um, not breed as much in the winter? Do they cut back on their... Probably a little bit. Because they don't go but out it as depends. much. But it depends as well because, like, we're pretty mild here. Like, I know in America they pretty much wrap their hives in silver blankets and... I like, probably have to do that if you're in Canberra and down south, you know. Yeah, because you know? yeah. hives are usually buried under snow. Yeah. A lot of them lose hives over over winter, over winter. And that. but I mean that's because you know they got sub-zero temperatures. I, I think like that whoever it was that put it on the flow hive page that time, um, the guy had it actually the back of the hive in his greenhouse so that the front was just out. I thought that was a good idea, and that way even when you're doing the bees aren't coming out the back to mm, investigate, to check the honey. Yeah. Out. That's actually a bit darker than I thought it was going to be. It's still a very light honey. Mm. It's lighter than the last lot we yeah, got. Yeah, it is a lot lighter. And a lot thicker too. Mm. Even though it's just a cooler day. Well, that's, that's got something to do with it. That's why Dad wanted you to come up and do it now. Yeah, I've been... Are almost. you fully open, are you? No, no. No, it's about three quarters. But... <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. I'm not going to push it too much because I don't want it flooding too much bloody. See the floor over there? Hey. Oh. I think there's so many of them around today. They no. normally don't have flies. It's annoying though. Hmm? It's annoying. Mm. 